time for Did You Watch It? How does this show work? We watch what we like, we talk about what we watched, and maybe you'll like what you hear. I'm Liz. And I'm Neil. Last night, we watched the pre-show special for The Bachelor, Season 18. The special aired on Sunday, January 5th, 2014. Here's what we thought about it. In, in watching the show, I had a few questions. And, and I'm hoping that you can help me with those. I totally can. Okay. And since you have never watched any of the shows on the Bachelor franchise... This is true. I am happy to be your doorway into the crazy. Okay, good. That this, it is. All right. And so we have Juan Pablo... Excuse me. Juan, Juan Pablo, Pablo. Who is a single dad living in Miami. Yes. With his uh, four-year-old daughter... Uh, soon to be five, according to yes the broadcast. Camila. Camila, who's who's darling, by the way. Adorable. She's, she's, she's very cute. Just like her dad. Yes. One thing that concerns me is the fact that there are going to be twenty-seven women. Yes. That he had that he gets to gets to choose from. Yes. Given the most the, in Bachelor history. The most in Bachelor yes. history. Okay. Usually there's just twenty-five. All right. That that well. Congratulations to The Bachelor for reaching new heights. Single dad with daughter. I see baby mama drama <laughs> not too long from now. Probably. They Probably. didn't really get into that, so I'm not really sure. And I can't really remember from The Bachelorette if the ex was in the picture. Okay. It's been a while. Okay. I've been waiting for this premiere for a long time. Really? Yes. Alrighty then. So, 27 women. Yes. And, and somehow... I use the term women loosely. All righty. Because some are girls. Yes. Yes, very much so. As we've seen uh, with the, the coming attractions uh, yes. segment there, some are, some are definitely girls. Yes. But Not I'm... to mention the audition tapes. Oh, oh I'm going to get to the audition tape. <laughs> Trust me. I'm going to get to the audition tape. So the show... You know, it was very nice. They they explained a lot. You know, me not having seen The Bachelor, I'm not unfamiliar with the reality show, you know, find the one you love type process. Not unfamiliar with it. I've never seen a show that had so many prospects to choose from. Really? Yeah. I mean, the one, I mean, I go, I go back a ways. I mean, I remember, you know, For Love or Money. I watched both of those. Yeah, 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 me and too. And Joe Millionaire. Yes, which totally. I, which I absolutely Which loved. were probably all based on The Bachelor because The Bachelor was so successful. Yeah. Everybody wanted to do like fake Bachelor. So okay. they came up with all these other concepts. Well, now, I don't know how long The Bachelor goes and we can... I A can long Google time. I can Google this later. Trista and Ryan. Okay. Long time. All right. Because I know, I know the first Joe Millionaire was like 2000. Okay. So I think it's probably before that. All right then. Very good. Yeah, because Trista was out of the first Bachelor. What was his name? Alex Michelle or something? Okay, I can't you remember. know way more. I do. I know. I'm a fan. I'm a super fan. I can't help myself. All right, you go, girl. Now, <laughs> 27 women to choose. Up. You know, by the end of the show, by the by the time all this is done, they will all be cycling together because <laughs> you have that many women. Absolutely. Be, yeah. There's going to be some stuff going on. Yes. You know, and, and the amount of PMS is simply staggering. Yeah, yeah. That, that's a lot of estrogen in one room. But, you know, once again, I'm not sexist. <laughs> the casting process. Yes. There were some very interesting videos oh, that they showed. Oh, my gosh. Yes. Oh, all right. The one, that, the one that really caught my attention was the one that said that uh, she. The reason that she applied to be on the show was that she was tired of being somebody's booty call. Yeah. Okay. If you don't want to be somebody's booty call, don't answer the phone. <laughs> I, I don't think that's a difficult concept but, to embrace. Yes, but. I totally get that. But I think it's safe for us to assume that this was a girl with really big self-esteem issues. Anyway, to okay. start with. All right. Is issues. I will embrace yes. issues. Absolutely. Yes. Another, 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 like little note Wait, that I took. Wait, that's the one that most caught your attention. Oh no, 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 no! no. There were, there were. Come a couple. on, because there were there like were a few. There oh were my a god! Few. No, Look, okay. one, one note I made. It's like have cue cards for grandma. <laughs> if you're gonna have your grandma, <laughs> the pageant. Yeah, yes, the pageant. Exactly. The pageant. Yeah, for the pet. No, no, have have some cue cards. Give her something to read. Exactly. Help, 
help her help you. Yeah, give that, her a little prep time. You know, and then when they were going through like the checks and the, oh, I'm looking for love. And then they put the little green checks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why do the women who flirts with girls get an ex? Because <laughs> I, don't, I don't know about Juan Pablo, but for me, that would kind of be a selling point. You know? Exactly. For just, you. Just, for me, but you know, not but apparently for this is why, this Juan is why, Pablo. Yes, this is why I'm not the bachelor. Exactly. Oh, and and the and the all timer was the last one. The the girl who lost her virginity two weeks before the audition. Yeah, that was that kinda was kind of creepy. That was creepy. That totally officially creepy. creepy. Okay. Yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. And the and the the girl. Please, that... I can't believe you're a guy, and that's the one you forget. Well, it's not that I forgot it. I just didn't. Come on, a girl who a... can put her entire fist in her mouth well, on national know. TV, okay. and did it. See, I you know, I just think she's special. <laughs> you know, it just I, that's that's where I filed her. I yeah, filed yeah. her under special. Yeah. All right. Yeah. We'll, we'll do that. Okay. I, I couldn't have been a part of that casting process at all because mm -mm. that was just disaster for me. So, okay. The notification <clears throat> was very interesting. It was interesting that Lauren, I think her name was Lauren in Edmond, Oklahoma. Yeah. Who is a mineral coordinator. Yeah. What the hell is a See, mineral coordinator? I don't coordinator? know. And I'm sure that we will find out. And as the judging from progress. that house, it pays pretty well. Yeah. Oh, Hello. <laughs> Hello, it's Minerals. And then you had Christy in Chicago, who was the marketing manager. Yeah. And and Elise in Hollywood, who's the first grade teacher. Now, okay, first grade teacher, she's living pretty well, considering she was a first grade teacher. Exactly. All right, so, hmm. Yeah, maybe there's a little income supplement from parents or yeah. roommate. And or we're going to leave it at that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> He is the first Latino bachelor yes. ever. Yes. Who looks like every other bachelor. But, you know, that's... No, <laughs> no and I'm not taking it anyway. No, he doesn't. He doesn't. He, if you line them all up, yeah. seriously, he doesn't okay. look like every other bachelor. Okay, good. Okay, good. Once again, I have no point of reference. So. Well, exactly. All right. And I'll help you out with that as we go along. All right, You cool. know, we had Andrew Firestone. We had Jake Pavelka. You know, a lot wow. of different types of guys. All right. hot. Of course. All very dateable. Of course, because it is The Bachelor. All look great with a shirt off. Yeah. And you see a lot of that throughout the whole show. Thank you for the warning. Yes, you're All right. And then we met his family. Yes. And... Oh, his dad was so cute. I loved his dad. I his know. His dad was, I mean... I felt out of the bad whole... kind of listening in on that moment. It was like a really... It, it was authentic. Yeah, there was, there it was, was. There was a level of authenticity that I didn't feel... From any of the contestants at all, because they were just, <laughs> you know, it's like I'm just, but 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 Dad, it's like, wow, it's like I I, yeah. I was a little moved he to was, actually yeah, be a part really of that cool. moment, and I, I I'll send him a note, sweet and, man, and say thank you. Oh, just a note to ABC. Yeah. Niece is spelled N I E C E. Oh. Okay, because when they did the projection. Okay. Uh, of the, you know, with the, the, the niece calling in. Yeah. Okay. They, they like totally blew. I know, but hello, we're wrong. watching The Bachelor. We're not doing spell check. This is one of the things that I catch. I know, though. I know, I know, but you're I missing the spirit of the show. The uh, no, no, spirit no. of the show is what we're here to talk about, I which know. is a lot I, of crazy, a lot of fun, a lot of hopefully love. Yes. A good yes. outcome in the end. Exactly. And a lot of crazy drama. Did I already say that? You I said think crazy I did. drama. Well, but that's I, it all right. needs to be said twice. It needs to be said twice. Yes. But a you know, I will, drama. I will, I will give, I will give props to The Bachelor for recognizing uh, and acknowledging Gia. Yeah. Oh, don't bring me down. But okay. I, that just made me so sad because I love Gia, and I think so many people love Gia, and she was such a sweet soul and genuine girl and yeah i just i appreciated the fact that they acknowledged her and remembered her because that was hard i think for all of us to to just go through that and hear about that because yeah she was just wonderful yeah i i you know having no point of reference you know it was i didn't 
have the same reaction that you did, but I totally understand how you can, you know, feel a bond with yeah. a character, even, you know, even though you've never met them, totally. you know, you get to see them in various, you know, situations and circumstances and you, you, you feel, you feel like, like you know them. Yeah. And because she'd been on bachelor pad a couple of times, I think twice, and then on the bachelor as well, you know, you start rooting for her. Mm -hmm. You, you know, believe in her and you're excited for her and all of those things. So well, that, anyway, you know. we love you, Gia, and we miss you. The first episode actually starts tomorrow and the crazy will ensue. Yes, and I cannot wait. So super excited. I'm I'm gonna say I'm looking forward to it. Can't right wait now, to get you hooked. Well and make a fan out of you. Oh okay, let's not get crazy. <laughs> let's not get crazy. <laughs> That's our time for today. Now we'd like to hear what you thought about it. You can comment, tweet, like, or just tell a friend. Thank you for listening.